Jennifer here, back with another edition of Movie Talk. Now, this week's movie is part of what is known as the Irish Folklore Trilogy, and it is actually the first of the Irish Folklore Trilogy. And that movie is Secret of Kells. Or The Secret of Kells. A young monk learns about the magic within the forest surrounding his home and in believing in himself as he helps to complete a book known as the Book of Kells. Okay, highlights of the movie. This movie was made back in 2009, so it's a fairly new movie. About 14 years old. Um, and it is an animated fantasy film that is about the making of the Book of Kells. And it is a story that is part of Irish folklore. And there's a lot of Irish folklore within the movie itself. And it's also the first in the Irish folklore trilogy by Studio Gimli. The second, the two others being in order, Song of the Sea and Wolf Walkers. And I will do reviews on those two as well. Okay, things I liked about the movie. I kind of like the animation. Um, it was relatively good animation. The storyline in and of itself, I mean, it was, the story was good. I'm not going to say the story was bad because it wasn't bad, but it jumped around a lot. Um, one minute they're in the Abbey writing down um, sacred words and whatnot, and the next minute, um, the young hero, he's in the forest with a shapeshifter and he's trying to get a gemstone from Crew Cullen, or not Crew Cullen, um, from Crumb Crusher, or the, the Death Worm from Irish Mythology. I, I don't know its name. I mean, I do know its name, but I know I'm not going to pronounce it right, so I'm not even going to try. Um, he's referred to as Crumb in this movie. And it's, it jumps around a lot, which was made it a little hard for me to follow the storyline the first time I watched it, and I've only seen it once. Um, the next few times I'll probably be able to follow the storyline a little bit better, because I'll know, okay, they're going to be jumping around a lot. There's not... There's a flow, but there's not a flow to a degree. Um, but it's still a good movie. I liked it. I mean, the animation was wonderful. Um... I, I loved the characters, um, the brothers, the abbot, um, the little changeling, um, she was cute, um, and the fact that it really delves into Irish folklore, I really liked a lot as well. So, I mean, all in all, it wasn't a bad movie, I just could have done with all the jumping around. It, it To me, it seemed like it was all over the place. Okay, cast. This movie had a very good cast of actors. Um, of course, the lead was Brandon. I believe that's how you say his name. Um, followed by the little shapeshifter. Um, but, the, you know, there were others, and they're mostly um, brothers and Brandon's uncle, the abbot. But still, I mean, amazing cast of actors.
other videos.
Okay, before I sign off, a few things I'd like to touch on. First off, a quick reminder on my comment rules. Okay, please leave your comments and questions in the comment section. I do love to read those. Also, feel free to follow me on Wattpad, Tumblr, Instagram, and Twitter. I do have my name for those four sites right there on the screen, as well as the pictures I use for the icons. Please note that all pictures seen within this video do belong to their respected artists. I own absolutely nothing. And the links for any sites mentioned will be in the description section. Okay, YouTube subscribers. Any of my videos that cannot be found on YouTube are on my Facebook page. Facebook friends, basically the same deal. Any of my videos that cannot be found on Facebook are on my YouTube channel. And to anyone who's interested, you can feel free to check out my Facebook group, Fanfic Corner. Okay, please like and share if you're watching on Facebook, or like and subscribe if you haven't already, if you're watching on YouTube. And as always, thank you for watching, and have a nice day.